how thin is good to be thin when you're forging in your standard? It depends on the knife. Some For Japanese knives are fucking like this thick, some are not. It depends on what's happening at the end and depends what the knife is used for. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I tell people, if you're going to make culinary knives, you need to fucking cook with them. You need to understand what's happening at the edge point and then up through the thing. Like, I don't do S-grinds. I can, I've done it. I don't prefer it as my kitchen knife. I do very traditional Japanese style chef knives that aren't all right. Knife. But there's a lot of like stigmas. Like people say that you have to grind it so thin that you're, you, you can deform the edge with your fingernail. I don't really believe in that. I think there is some reason to do that for certain things, but I don't, not all my knives do that. What's you the know? average thickness you better to leave it before you started to doing a heat treatment? There is none, and there is no standard thickness to like, everything is distal tapered, everything. So everything is distal tapered, so you need to be able to measure and understand from, you don't want like a blade that's thinner than an eighth inch all the way out through the tank. Right. You know what I mean? You'd rather leave it a little fuller in the back, this is tapered to the front. There so is, is it good to is, have a distal taper only on the chef knife or generally for all the knives? Every knife should have a distal taper, right? I mean, when can be, right? Like everything in, in itself, even swords. Like if you look at like katanas, like they don't distal taper very much, but they do taper at the last like 10 to 15% of the blade. Right, right. You know? I tell everybody the same way I teach my sons, like I don't teach my sons how to forge first and then grind later. I teach them to fucking grind first. It's more important to be better at stock removal than it is forging. Forging is a like a legacy. Forging is like a like an added bonus. But being able to grind well is more important than forging. To me. Because I did it the reverse where I forged everything and I was so horrible at grinding, but it didn't matter. But it took me years to catch up to how good everybody else ground. Like nobody, I, I could forge well, but I couldn't grind well. I wish Jess could be here because she knows that my number one thing that I don't like to do is be asked questions and I would wish that she was here to yeah. see be like, wow, look at Neil ask all the answer all these <laughs> but, uh, questions. We have, we, have a, we have a proof on the camera <laughs> so we can show it. 